Welcome back to Marvel Ultimate Alliance. Let's play. When we last left off, we beat up the lamest supervillain team ever. And now we're selecting a new team for the next mission. We're going to play as the Avengers West Coast now. Moon Knight. He'll start Moon Knight to uh, Hawkeye. Which many feel is a stupid superhero just because he uses a skill from the 21st century. This is his best power. As is this. I think it's that one. He has lots of cool powers, actually. Hope not enough for his ultimate whatever attack. Let's see. That's his best costume. Put some more into Moon Knight, because he kicks ass. Now we need Spider-Woman. Spider-Woman. But she has to be in her, uh... Have we used her yet? Yep, we've used her. She needs to be in her uh, Secret Wars outfit because that's the because in the West Coast Avengers it was the second Spider Woman, not the first one. And finally, uh, we need another Avenger. Uh, crap, I forgot. Let's just Hulk? Hulk. No, not you. We have have we even played as Hulk yet? No. Wow. Well. Okay, Miss Marvel. Ms. Marvel. Nope. Uh. Uh, let's see. Thor? Thor. No. Blue Cage? Blue Cage. No. Wolverine? Wolverine. No. Iron Man? Iron Man. West Coast of Oh, great. We have to use Iron Man. Mr. Boring McMoringson. Oh, crap. Cough, sneeze. <sighs> My apologies. Haven't even used this douchebag yet. We'll use his corny ultimate costume. And there, yeah, the West Coast way. Avengers, which eventually reformed into the Force Works that had U.S. Agent on it, actually. Unfortunately, U.S. Agent did not appear in the Iron Man animated series where Hawkeye took his place, that stupid jackass. And since we can complete that mission, we can now go into that tall, that douchebag Viking wouldn't let us go in. And look, a focus up. I'm giving it to Moon Knight because he kicks ass. Well done. Yeah, get out of my way, transparent man. There's Spider Woman, the wrong Spider Woman. We're playing as the Julia, or which one of the? Wait, is that? I think that's Jessica on the loading screen. The second one is Julia. Then there was a third one I forgot the name of. Hello, valiant warriors. Yeah, 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 Ragnarok, whatever. I've played Too Human, and I did not enjoy Too Human. Do not get that game, it's awful. Hey, we can talk to these morons. Welcome. The choosers of the slain are war- No, what you saw, that is the- It is our- Yeah, you- Yeah, I hope you die. And these look exactly like the Vikings we've been fighting, too. How are we supposed to tell them apart? And here they are. Oh, and here's something stupid. Hi there, buddy. What do you do? It. Ow! And his axe flies off into space after hitting me. You jackass. I don't think it can kill you, though. I tell you what. Life is I weasel bully. at the X-Mansion. If it weren't for that, I've got one last idea to... All right. Why is- why is everyone use names as their passwords? Alright, Moon Knight leveled up. Oh crap, I forgot to check his powers. Can we access his NUNCHUCK POWER? This is like- this power kicks ass. There's Thor. Let's give this to Hawkeye so he can use his extreme attack. Go down! Thank you. And there's Deadpool. Yeah, you know, this team needs a cat. Mm, we can call ourselves. I've got a rat. Yeah. Oh, Deadpool, you're so fun. Valkyrie actually comes on to him if you're playing as him. And talk to her. <laughs> Deadpool got his own game. It wasn't too bad of a game either. There's Jessica again. Two loading screens in a row. You are 
real camera hog. So yeah, Asgard. It literally is just a series of floating continents that, that exist in another dimension. And it's been destroyed like three times in the Marvel series, actually. I'm serious, look it up. Now let's talk to Mr. Hank Pym. Hey, how are ya? Yeah, the only not really. He's one of you'll have to come back. Oh, and also, this is the portal to Olympus. Why is there why there's a portal to Olympus on Asgard is unknown. Because they're gods, I guess? That's probably the only thing. You don't even see Zeus that much in the Marvel universe. You did everything you could. Yes. He is a dreadful man. He created it. Okay, so it's clearly not Dr. Eines. Although, if she wanted to be clever, it, it would be Dr. Eines, but apparently she isn't that clever in this game. And he keeps going back here and we can talk to him again, but we don't have to, so we can just brush him aside like a douchebag and just go in. There's Invisible Lady. He really should have called her that. Invis I'm Invisible Lady! <laughs> Here's some more of these douchebags. Douchebags all over this game. There's Mr. Axeman. It didn't even hit the pole. He was just floating there. Here's Weasel again. <laughs> Is I know, Blackwood. It's Ivan, hey. douchebag. You can thank me later with cash. Alright, you little... You're a greedy little bastard. I should shoot you with an arrow. Simulator, Thor, what a surprise. This is his home world after all. And let's talk to Valkyrie real quick. Why does that scoundrel need Ha! Though I must admit. Fair yeah, whatever. Goodbye. Oh, Valkyrie. Who the hell said that? Oh, that was creepy, it's a ghost! Ah! 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 I'm right across the table and getting all the food dirty. Ah. I actually saw some West Coast Avenger comics available up at the local exchange shop. I actually got Star Trek Voyager for the PS2 there, and there's Sith still fighting. Sith, I meant Sith. Very different. And let's go to go rescue Baldur's ass. Where he'll become a cyborg and stuff like in Two Human. Again, don't get that. <laughs> and more high tech and more in my jet flame jets. Of dreams. How I wish I could forever relive the fall of Asgard. It was so amusing to watch the You think any of the villains ever like oogled their faces in Enchantress's breast? Like <laughs> I'd like to see that. Was lost. Heimdall, Tear. And even the mighty Balder have tasted the bitter drinks. <laughs> Get rid of those horns, you look now, retarded. Loki! And he doesn't have the veil anymore! Why did he have a veil in the cutscene? And all those who had dared to mock me are in chains, beaten, and hopeless. Need I remind you, Loki, that your brother Thor still remains free? Your Her eyes are really close. The God of Thunder grows tiresome in Really close together. Or has he not proven himself your better? Time and time again. This is like a lower grade cutscene than the one where they invaded Asgard. Did they really use up all the money in those for those cutscenes? Valid point to light. Thor will likely attempt to liberate the fallen warriors. Think you that I would not be prepared? Traps a plenty wait for those who would dare to free my prisoners. Traps that even they cannot overcome. You underestimate me, Doom. After all, am I not the god of mischief? My brother and his friends will most assuredly enter Asgard. But trust me when I say they will never leave. Oh really? Then why did I kill the Wrecking Crew? Eh, you th ever think about that, smartass? There's Storm. That stupid black crown thing. Very good. There's Sif. Now yeah, we could go this way, or we could go this way, which I didn't even know existed the first few times I played this game. Like everything else. Get over the rock! Don't fall in the pit! I haven't sh even showed off your powers yet, Hawkeye. And a cutscene. And now we're fighting trolls! Yeah, we're fighting Gnorga from Troll in Central Park. She's gonna turn us to stone, but we're gonna shoot an arrow through her face, which is what Stanley- Freaking idiot, you- 
Damn it! it didn't absorb. Here. Ah, paralyzer, paralyzer. Yeah, this is what Stanley in Troll Central Park he should have. He should have, like shot a flurry of arrows at her <laughs> into her face and killed her. Now that. And we set them on fire, too. Yeah, that would have made that terrible movie much more better if there was an epic fight scene. Where Stanley beats the living shit out of Ganorga. What What the hell kind of name is that? That is stupid. And there's the Hammer of Vidar, the brother of Thor. And unfortunately, he only appears in two comets, so no one gives a crap about him. Give this to Hawkeye before forgetting about him forever after this mission. And hitting this anvil lowers that force field. Now we can go bash some heads in with this. So is Earth, like, right below us? If I mean, if we fell off here, would we eventually slam into Earth like that giant robot thing from Castle in the Sky? That would be kind of cool, just some... You're just minding your own business, like, d working in the yard one day, and suddenly a bod the body of Hawkeye slams down into your tractor, your lawnmower, and you scream in terror like the sky is falling. There's a save point. And here's this thing. This thing's kind of stupid. Hey, let's trigger a cutscene when we go here. Pay homage to Might of Thor, son of Odin. Only by casting the elemental power of lightning upon this statue will you be allowed to go past without doing shit. So if you have Thor or Storm, you, they can trigger it. Although if their powers aren't powerful enough, they won't be able to do it. And you'll have to go through the wall of battle. Which I prefer anyway, because you get more experience from that. How'd that be, Chief? And the hammer of Vidar actually isn't that great. Yep, go ahead and break that weird brazer thing since I hit it. These little bastards try to steal this hammer from me occasionally. Money! Attack them! And we get a special cutscene here. What's this? And we can't stop him from worrying the others, because the cutscene lets him get away. Oh no, my hammer! Give me back my hammer! My pet poodle fights harder than you! Man, I feel good! Oh, shut up, Hawkeye. And now Iron Man leveled up. The humans are here! He made like 15 suits of armor, pro possibly even more. He's wearing a white suit currently, I fired. If I'm right. Or a black one, I don't know. I just saw it on the Marvel Wiki. And we kills slaughtered 50 trolls. Aw, oh, what a beautiful, well-carved totem pole. Smash it! <laughs> Cower in fear as I smash your totem poles, Asgard! You should all be fired on grounds of being weak and pathetic. Oh, shut up, Hawkeye. You're the one. You quit the Avengers three times. You're the one who's the most pathetic. You're like, eh, my, what, my girlfriend died. Uh, I'm going to quit the Avengers. Then one time he just left a note on a refrigerator saying he quit. I'm serious. That actually happened. Ooh, Hawkeye's nano belt. And he picked up both of them. What a greedy snob. Nah, that's a bad thing. Where's Spider-Woman? Ooh, that gives her more power, so we're going to give her that, and blah blah blah. Will you stop attacking the brazer? It didn't do anything! I just hit it accidentally! Get back here. Follow me, guys. Got it. Follow me, guys! <laughs> oh, Hawkeye, you're such a ham. And that's all the trolls here, so let's go back to the Statue of Thor and smash it, too, because we're jackasses.
Okay. Mm -mm. More of these braziers. Does it ever rain in Asgard? I don't know. That would be. That's kind of a neat question. What, and if it did rain, would the rain that goes over the side go to Earth? Ooh, sp mystery. And we aren't gonna do that, so let's just go to the wall of battle and start killing some bitches. Use the wall of battle! And we can get complete this much faster if we, uh... This troll can spawn from those stupid statue things, and if we just throw them all into the fire, it, we only have to kill four of them. To... Sure. Here, watch. Oh, see? One of them smashed already. Now there's only one left. Goodbye. And problem solved. And sometimes it does this cutscene twice. Really glitchy, I'm telling you. Yeah, we get it. Come on, let's move along. Oh, it didn't do it this time. How good. Now let's go through here. And Baldur's right up here. Where he's being held prisoner by two bolts of lightning. I should have known, friend. Two of my brethren are also imprisoned. You will... Can't we just smash those statues? And you're the god of whatever. You're, shouldn't you be... Can't you be strong enough to break it? You're second only in Thor. The humans are here. And we can't smash these support beams because they're far too powerful for even the hammer of Vidar. Faster than you. Now we have a choice of where to go. The east wing or the west wing. Let's kill some more of these turkeys. Ow. No, I failed Loki. And there's a super duper extreme -y thingy. If you had, the, if these were all members of a, your official super duper hero team, they would, uh, you would have been able to and put some points into the momentum upgrade. You would have gotten f momentum faster. Unfortunately, we aren't doing that, so who cares? Get out of the way, you morons! Jeez, they always do that. Hell then. I think the one with the save point is over here. Only one of these has a save point in it, although we can also just teleport out and use the save point there. Fuck, helmets, let's crush them. That's what the super soldiers say when we encounter them. And we lost the hammer of Idar. Ah, oh, good, this is the right way. Smash this, smash that, and that. Let's see. And there they are. Look! Helmets, let us destroy them, blah, blah, blah. Adamantium arrow! Didn't do shit. Sorry I keep cursing. And let's read what this statue says. Ready to open his jaws for the hand of Tia. Seriously, arrows. That's all Hawkeye does, is shoot arrows. I mean, it's not as bad as some of the other heroes, like, uh... The West Coast Champions. Those are... Those guys are complete losers. Like, Flatman! Ooh! Mr. And Mr. Immortal! Ooh! Smash thousands of priceless artifacts. Dun. Moon Knight suit. Hmm, let's see. They never give me stuff for the people on my team. Let's see. It has higher defense. Let's get rid of the war belt and equip that. Okay, I'm gonna cut the video off here real quick.